Congress is moving forward with its investigation into Hillary's criminal email activity as Secretary of State with the usual results. Administration officials and other Clinton operatives are still stonewalling or otherwise refusing to cooperate. Meet Justin Cooper. He's a former aide to Bill Clinton, but more importantly, he is the IT specialist who personally set up Hillary's private server, email system, and devices. On Tuesday, he admitted having no national security clearance whatsoever, neither while working for the Clintons, including while he was setting up and maintaining the private server, laptops, and Blackberries, nor while he had unrestricted access to Hillary's email and other documents as Secretary of State. He also said he was aware of multiple hacking attempts on Hillary's private server. Cooper is mentioned in an FBI report as having destroyed evidence. More specifically, he took a hammer to Hillary's Blackberries. Also on Tuesday, Paul Combetta and Bill Thornton, two employees of Platte River Networks, the Colorado IT company hired to perform maintenance on Hillary's private server, also appeared before Congress. Combetta was asked point blank who told him to delete the emails, but he, like Thornton, refused to answer any questions, but rather invoked the Fifth Amendment right to not self-incriminate. Another Clinton lackey, Brian Pagliano, a former IT specialist in the State Department, was also subpoenaed to testify against Hillary, but failed to appear. On this, Representative Chaffetz commented, quote, When you are served a subpoena for the United States Congress, it is not optional, unquote. That may be true for you and me, but as we've learned, Hillary, her people, and any official in this administration for that matter, is above the law. Just how much power and persuasion do the Clintons have over people who've worked for them? These guys would rather plead the fifth, which is protection against self-incrimination, than answer the question, who told you to delete the emails? That can only mean one thing. Somebody told them to do it. I guess they don't want to be added to the Clinton body count. Pagliano is so terrified, he disobeyed a congressional subpoena. Imagine for a moment knowing damning information about Hillary and having to start your car for the rest of your life. Thanks for listening. Don't forget to subscribe and donate at theraywarnershow.com.